Nintendo Treehouse, can I just have a one-on-one conversation with you? Just for a moment, okay? Come here. Yes, it's about the issues that you have, but don't worry. The principals won't be here at any moment. If anything, you're better off dealing with me than with the principals. They're seriously pissed off at you, but I'm here going to you on a fairly neutral ground. I'm not doing the stuff that they're doing. They're just going to enjoy other students that make better products and cause less problems than you. But you're one hell of a student to deal with, and they're mad. But they want me to deal with you. Because they couldn't even be bothered to do so. So please, do listen to me, alright? We need to examine your past behaviors. So, as a student of our wonderful School of Translators, can you explain to me what's going on with this? Now, this wouldn't have been a problem if this was just a slip-up or a developmental mistake, but this is not a slip-up. This happens constantly throughout your game, Fire Emblem Fates, with constant horrendous translations, very well documented in Know Your Meme, by the way, and from what appears to be based on that video, 99.9% cut content. And yes, I know what you're gonna say. Uh, direct translations are gonna be a bit too confusing for people to understand. So we absolutely have to make some changes in order for things to make sense in context. Well, we have grown tired of that excuse. You've said that too many times now. And it seems like you keep on saying that in order to cover up things like this. How can you even call this a change? If by change you mean remove all the dialogues because we couldn't be bothered to translate them then what's the purpose of you even existing? Why do you even have to exist as a separate entity from Nintendo? And why do you simply refuse to do your job? The issue here at hand is now changed. It's not whether or not you actually translate the game faithfully to the source material, it's whether or not you actually translate the game. I cannot believe that we even have to go to this point, Treehouse. Calling your work lazy is an honor. At least lazy results exist. So what you're saying here is that you're a translator for Nintendo who doesn't even translate video games, but you get the money anyway. No wonder why people are getting so mad at you right now. So, Treehouse, you have lots and lots of Nintendo intellectual properties in your hands, including Fire Emblem. You have control over the translations of Nintendo games. The principals are, of course, going to throw pitchforks and fire at you by the time they notice this, but I won't. Let me send you what they're trying to say. Do your job and make it good. That's it. That's all they're asking. They're not asking you to submit to them. They're not asking you to worship them. They simply ask you to just do your job and do it well. That's all. Is it so hard? Frankly, that's all I'm asked from you too. That's what I'm going to ask to everybody living on planet Earth. I'm just asking you to do your job and do it well. I'm asking you just those two simple things. We're asking you those two simple things. So would you just please stop whatever this nonsense is. Reconsider your important position here at Nintendo and do your job well. Thank you, Treehouse. I hope that we don't see each other again in this unfortunate circumstance. (sighs) Treehouse. It's unfortunate that we meet again in this particular situation. A few months ago, all I'm asking for you is for you to do your job well. All I'm asking you is to make sure that your translations are good. However, it seems to me that you decided to use one of your work to throw a temper tantrum over the topics of our recent meeting. Can you explain to me what this is? Distort, please read it. Ha! Whoever localized this manga clearly didn't understand the source material like I do. The main character's name is supposed to be a joke about Japanese food, obviously. I'm watching the anime they made from this manga to see what they cut out or got wrong. Isn't it great that no matter the culture, I can find something I hate about something that I claim to like? What's that? This is a character who happens to be just like that? I'm taking some of these out of context? Well, I'm just gonna accept that for a moment. How about this? 
and that may be precisely why the ancient ruins I encountered have been left undisturbed for me to explore. Still, coming here at least afforded me the rare chance to explore these ancient ruins. So ancient, such ruin. I know that translations and interpretations of words and sentences can be different, definitely, for some people to people, but why does the American version need to insert a meme reference? Let's get back to the first one, and just assume that you are representing people who are complaining about localization, especially the last sentence. Isn't it great that no matter what the cultures are, I can find something I hate about something I claim to like? What are you even talking about? Are you saying that people who complain about bad translations or even lack of translations are hating on this just because they're hateful, pathetic weeboos? It's unfortunate for me to say this to you, Nintendo Treehouse, but these people are your audiences. These hateful, pathetic weeboos that complain to you about your bad translations do not complain to you because they hate you. They complain because your translation is bad. However, you refuse to admit that. So you throw a temper tantrum by unleashing your rage upon them in a video game. This is very immature of you, Nintendo Treehouse. I really expect you all to just act like reasonable adults. But how can I expect this from you when this is the kind of quality translation that you give? All we want you to do is just to translate the game and translate it well. And yet you throw a massive temper tantrum when being asked to do this simple job. You have not pleased any of the principles here, Treehouse. Because you haven't done any of your job, and even if you do, you haven't done it well. These principles are very easy to pull their support off of you if you keep slacking off like this and acting like an immature kid. They will not tolerate any of these embarrassing endeavors. Soon enough, people will start noticing the bad things that you do here and pull their support off of future games because they simply cannot tolerate bad translations. And if you're gonna say, then why don't you learn Japanese? Well. That's your job, Treehouse, as a translator. If you refuse to do your job, maybe that is indeed a good advice. People should learn Japanese. And by the time they have, maybe they will do a better job on translating the game than you ever will. Until then, your role here is insignificant. You're not pleasing the principals. You're not pleasing the audiences. It's all thanks to you slacking off. And when you get called out for it, you throw a massive temper tantrum. Treehouse, pull any of these stunts again. And these principals are going to pull their support off of your games. I guarantee you that. So please, make yourself useful. Do your job and do it well. That's all I'm asking. You may leave. But once again, I'm warning you.